Well, to celebrate Easter this weekend, a Christian women's group put this display in the Wisconsin Capitol building. It includes a cross and information pamphlets. And in response, the Freedom From Religion Foundation set a sign, put it right there, saying that nobody died for our sins. Jesus Christ is a myth. Well, when it comes to religious holidays, should atheists have equal opportunity? Joining me now is a woman who put up the Easter display, the original one we just showed, Wisconsin State Director of Concerned Women for America, Kim Simic. Good morning. Good morning, Elizabeth. So what was your reaction then? You, you put this display up that we showed, and then someone from the Freedom From Religion Foundation went in, they put a sign up that said, no one died for your sins. Your initial reaction was? Um, you know, our beautiful rotunda, rotunda here in the state of Wisconsin is a venue of free speech. People are welcome, all citizens welcome, of any interest to share. We applied, Concerned Women for America of Wisconsin applied for a permit and put up a beautiful display that gives honor and reverence to, at Easter time, sure. to the most important man who ever lived, Jesus Christ. Kim, let me ask you this then, because so, you, you, you know freedom of speech then, is it the right then, and, and is it honoring, you know, our constitutional right of freedom of speech for this uh, atheist group to go and put their sign up? I think absolutely is. I mean, I, I feel, um, I don't know why they felt with their statement, their press release, that they felt they needed to counter us. But I do think that it's absolutely great that they can have their, um, their display out there, too. Their name, their foundation name is Freedom From Religion. In America, we have freedom of religion. And atheism is their religion. And I honor that for them. I respect that for them. And I hope that they would respect that hundreds of millions of Christians around the world this week are going to be celebrating the most wonderful event in our lives, and that's the resurrection of Jesus Christ. So I hope that they're happy for us because we are happy for them. Sure. You know, this is a, 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 the holiest of weeks, whether you are Jewish or Christian. This is a, certainly an important one, but you bring up an important word, respect, because it's a right. It could still be wrong when it comes to just being civil, correct? Correct. Well, you know, many of these people really preach tolerance, but it, yet that we don't see a real level of it from them. The statement in the press release seems very an attack item against women, against uh, the cross. Um, it, it's just not necessary. Uh, we don't feel that way towards them. We wish them well. We um, wish that they would see the beauty that Jesus Christ brings to our life. But if they choose to uh, follow a different path, then that's, that's, their, that's their objective. I mean, that is their, um, their prerogative. So they are very um, welcome to have their display. I hope that the hundreds of children that come through our rotunda in Wisconsin will enjoy ours. Sure. And if somebody doesn't want to visit ours, they don't have to stop by it. Sure. Do you see this as promoting atheism or an attack on Christianity, so to speak? Should the government's role be also to protect uh, the religious freedom of, of religion, whatever it may be, um, and, not, and prevent these kind of attacks in the minds of many? I don't think that we should prevent this. I mean, people are free to do what they want in this country. Um, we need to protect that. It's my right to be able to put a display in my state capitol, and this um, woman, it's her right to put hers out there. Uh, let people decide for themselves what it is they want to follow in this life, what makes them happy. To millions of people around the world, and especially for hundreds of thousands of concerned women across America, sure. um, we are very happy with the, the message that Jesus Christ brings to our life. So uh, this is a Judeo-Christian country, and we're happy to stand up and remember right. that and honor the legacy that is America. Kim Simek, thanks for being with Fox and Friends this morning. Sometimes a right Thank you. can be very wrong at times. So what do you think? Is it free speech or intolerance? We're going to read your emails on that next. That's me in the corner.